again, the national spotlight is shining on local barbecue. Oh, this time it's a Bonner Springs restaurant sandwich that's making stomachs growl. Ben Chandler serves up one monster of a meal. Yeah, it's big. That's why Bob Caviar calls it the ultimate destroyer. Now we're basically weighing half pounds of everything. And he means everything. Pulled pork, a pork on the second layer, half a pound of turkey and a half a pound of ham, three half pound smoked hamburgers, brisket, barbecue, sausage. Lathered in sauce, bread in between layers with a pound and a half of fries and four pickles. If you finish it in 45 minutes, it's free. A task most pass on. No, not by myself. <laughs> I just soon live a little bit longer. I've probably had uh, 25, 30 people that have attempted it. Nobody has done it yet. This is the rules. And Papa Bob's a stickler for the rules. Oh, you got to keep it down. You got to sit there for five minutes after it's all over, too. Some of his customers figured they knew someone who might be up for the challenge. People would come in and say, you know, you ought to get that guy from Man vs. Food in here. And that's what happened. Man vs. Food's Adam Richmond traveled to Bonner Springs to take on the ultimate destroyer in May. How he did is a well-protected secret. I can tell you that he attempted to do it. Now, whether or not he finished it or not, that I can't tell you. Whether Adam finished the Ultimate Destroyer or not, Bob is grateful for the exposure sure to come his way. People will wait a lifetime to have an opportunity like this. I've been lucky. Ben Chandler, NBC Action News. Wow, you can feed a family of five oh, out of that. Well, you can find out what happened when Man vs. Food takes on the Ultimate Destroyer. It's tomorrow night at 8 p.m. on the Travel Channel. Papa Bob's Barbecue is holding a watch party.